host welcome back to i enigma this is enigma we're going to do your person on your mind read let's see what this person um is thinking feeling about you what is their next move and what's the most potential outcome with this person all right since this is a general take what resonates and leave what does not resonate for more personals you can reach out on whatsapp instagram and email details uh, will be provided below also go by prayer based spells and we have crystals for manifesting your desires <clears throat> subscribe for more videos on your sign videos let's see the messages for you the judgment the five of wands princess of pentacles seven of wands you're fighting a desire to go back i feel like you're fighting to not go back you're taking slow steps towards a new beginning it's it's hard but you're doing it I feel like you're still in this hope that things with someone from the past will still work out. Okay, but what you don't see coming is this new beginning. And with this person, you might probably get married or be in a beautiful relationship with. Because the one that's coming into your life is going to bring a lot of money, uh, luxuries and happiness, gifts. You will be prosperous. I'm seeing money, money, money. I'm seeing getting you know abundant with time so there's a solid new beginning with a lot of money coming in and a major commitment okay it's also because you're working hard to develop yourself learn grow imbibe update yourself become a better version of yourself and be at that point of stability once you've reached that point you will meet someone on the same page or I'm seeing your person's going to be even more successful than you are. Taurus coming in. I feel there's someone that's extremely stable that's coming in. Once you jump out of this toxic energy, which you know this is toxic, so I need to come out of this. There's no way out. Maybe this is a Scorpio that you're ending things with. I feel the Scorpio has been extremely toxic with you. Okay. If you have Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus sign in Scorpio, then don't forget to subscribe to my Scorpio channel, even if you're a cross watcher here. Okay. Some of you dealing with the cancer, that's also what I'm seeing. We have this Queen of Pentacles energy. <clears throat> You might be shocked to hear this, but that's the truth. You are becoming rich. You are becoming abundant. If you just focus all your energy into your ambition, because your focus is so strong. Right now, your focus is elsewhere. But if you shift it and become more focused in your ambition and your passion in life, you won't believe how successful that you have become. And a lot of prosperity coming in. There's major stability, promotion, growth, money, everything that you want, abundant life, material things. Everything's happening in your favor. All right. So I am seeing you will not, you know, you will get extremely uh, surprised with how far you've reached in your life, which makes you super strong and ambitious and, and confident that you do not want this toxic person in your life anymore. So prepare yourself for this major changes that's coming in your life first. Okay. I feel like you will build your your life and you will see something unexpected in your life coming in then we have the devil but there's a part of you that doesn't want to let go of this person on your mind there's a part of you that still wants to fix things and work on this is that part of you that is weak that's not strong that still wants to be abused or kind of you know you're okay with this narcissism from this person you have to understand that you should not be okay with it because you have to set an example for your kids in future for your family members for your 
for your friends if you're going to you know uh, do the same you know if you're going to you know let it happen and continue you know this narcissism on you you'll get trapped and that's bad i'm seeing a capricorn might be the one that you're trying to get out of the only thing that you need to do by getting out of this like cutting a cord you need to block this person and take a vow that you will never unblock them okay i feel there is slow step towards success you won't see immediate success since you're a human right so it takes time and slow is better than fast because if it's slow that means you're letting it go and heal yourself side by side and it's helping you you know uh remove this desire from the core in a way so yes work is required to come out of this mad situation you're in okay my gosh why do you even stick to this person because your whole world is about to change you know you know this you're going to start a new chapter in your life where you will be marrying someone extremely rich something or someone that's going to literally uh sweep you off in such a way that you don't want to go back you don't want anything else you just want this new person in your life there's a lot of uh stability in this connection there's a lot of money that that will grow with this person you guys together going to like multiply wealth this is a dream connection that you are you know avoiding and that is your soulmate this this dream connection this dream person is your soulmate so i feel like you're about to meet your soulmate but just because you stuck with this person it's not helping you it's not helping you need to close the chapter with them the moment you do this you'll see the new beginning this could be a gemini sagittarius so i have to be honest with you leo because this is how it is and this is how you can change your life that's why you're watching this read isn't it so the universe is asking you to decide between the two do you want to go towards something that's cold and superficial or you want to go to something that requires effort consistency will which will come to you later in life but that's stable that's fruitful that's long term that's grounded in stable energy what do you want out of these two whatever you pick the universe will give you more of that okay that's your decision now so an important decision needs to be made leo's some of you there's a libra around that you need to get rid of you're feeling emotional you're like i am emotional i have my emotions linked to this person how could i do this how could i even think of it you know i want to fix this maybe i'm married to this person blah 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 but i feel like this is very important for you to understand that there's deception involved okay and you don't want to be you know strung along do you want that the person stringing you along no some of you there's a cancer that you're dealing with you don't want to completely shut the door on this past person you know that there is a new beginning there will be a new beginning because you you know you're beautiful or handsome you know you're capable but you're stuck you're like you don't want to completely shut the door on something because you're heartbroken because you don't want to break yourself more you think that if you completely cut off the chapter with this person you'll break your heart even more and you do never want to go into a new relationship so i feel like it's all in your head right now because of the dopamine rush i feel that person gave you dopamine and you're used to that dopamine and nobody else is able to replace that feeling and now that it's taken up by the cortisol which is stress hormone you want to get that dopamine feeling back and you know that only this person can give you that dopamine feeling so you want to fight that a uh, cortisol you have to deal with it okay because this new beginning is amazing this new beginning brings a lot of love compassion this person will have a lot of compassion over you this new person so the future with this person that you're still stuck on is nil on and off nil okay ten of cups your future with someone new is going to be 
moving towards a deep commitment but i feel like if you keep this person around they will mess your life up they'll break everything for you they will not let you be in this happy place they if the moment you move on while keeping this person around they will come back and destroy everything so do you want that so this is what you don't see coming that a beautiful new beginning that's full of love passion desire and compassion for each other sympathy for each other respect for each other that's what is coming in and you have a cancer that might be coming in but you need to move on that's a clear message out there leos you won't see how happy and free you will feel from this person trust me on that and we have the strength and the six of cups you need to have that strength to move away from this energy of going back and reconciling maybe you're the one every time you go and reconcile with this person go back to them or expect them to reach out to you have to be strong right now you're appearing weak to me to this person to the world the tower it's time for you to take a major decision of fallout ending break up no more going back to the past leaving things behind and start dating new okay you will meet new people on your way to distract you from this person i see you will be cold to these new options you will still have that past person stuck in your head it's okay but not going back to the past please it'll take time for you to move on i'm not seeing you taking interest into new options coming to your life you just want to be alone you just want to be left alone that's what i'm seeing so don't blame you, you know don't punish yourself that's what i'm saying stop doing that bad health this person is giving you nightmares this person is a thief this person is not respectful at all towards you and i feel they might be a gambler in reality they might be hoarding money from people or from you they're not taking care of you when you're sick or this person is making you sick and you're someone that should be honored and this is what is coming for you that you're avoiding okay so let it go otherwise you'll be regretting your whole life i know i messed up everything and then we have the timing was just and just not right i love you you're the one that's been blaming yourself over this person you think that no enigma i was the one to be blamed because i messed up everything i did not understand them i did not give them time to get to know me i am this i am that i love them unconditionally i can't see anything but them i feel like that's the thing that you need to come out of for some of you who've already come out of it embrace so it's important that you have to understand that whatever it is it is you can't change it embrace it accept what it is and let it go this person is a flirt very soon you will let go of this person oh that's a great news i feel uh, some of you this is a gemini is it you're going to let go of this person this will the past will become a past for you and you will move towards a new relationship a happy new start a happy beginning with lots of money coming in rich people and ending up with a amazing partner you need a roller crossite you can get it from me i have pure roller crossite energized with pure intentions so you can book with me as well but right now what it is right now is to work on self love i feel roller crossite will really help you in bringing about that energy quickly inside of you that feeling of love towards self and healing towards self is important right now very very chop wood you might be doing the same old stuff from the long time and that is why your mind is not uh you know thinking uh out of the box so if you really want to go out of the box and do something new stop being in your old routine change your schedule do something new do something exciting so that you can come out of this energy and find answers yourself your your mind is blurred and confused right now 
you have a potential to be famous to shine and to become to live your dream life it's time for you to shine and i feel you will be shining through your life purpose so stop blaming yourself because you're ruining your energy you're draining yourself you're doubting yourself you're devaluing yourself that's not cool you have a lot of new options coming into your life a lot of options possibilities traveling is something that's going to keep you going and excited about new beginnings and not focusing on this person anymore and then we have you have to stick to your vision once block may, uh, means forever block once you've set a goal focus on it because that's how you will be successful what else then we have you have a new beginning coming into your life you're going to start a new journey like a new world is waiting for you okay i want to pull one more sometimes life strings so it's just a part and parcel of life it's not your ground reality it's not it's not going to stick around with you all the rest of your life you're just the one that's mooning over it okay stop doing that for some of you this is uh you've already come out of this negative situation okay now let me just pull out what are the signs that most probably you will be dealing with in the coming time in this month okay sagittarius for some of you this is a sag you need to come out of you need to come out of a cap capricorn or a pisces some signs okay out of these now i just want to go forward and see what is a person on your mind what is their next move towards you let's see that because i know you're curious they're watching you they'll be like the moment you you know switch this energy to focusing on self and you embrace the self love energy your person will be all eyes into you your person will be like in awe like how you're changing and how things are you know working out for you how you're becoming so independent and how finances in your life are growing how you are becoming successful i feel like this person is going to watch your growth real closely and be in awe if you take that energy back onto you four of pentacles okay they'll try to reach out to you okay and have you like a prized possession they will try to claim you they will never give you love it's just that you make them stand out in the crowd or you make them proud in public eye but in uh, behind the public when you guys are together and alone this person will treat you bad so all they want you is like an object so do you want to be a part of that no so here all they do is make your life even worse so you need to just you can do that like with distance in a distance like you you can make them watch you in a distance but don't be in their hands don't come back to them okay don't give them the charge i am not seeing them making any move but i'm definitely seeing them watching you grow secretly but not telling you exactly what's going on with them or not even reaching out to you or communicating with you but is constantly thinking about you watching you every move on social media the more you will bring out your strength the more they'll freak out in coming back and uh, trying to mess with you or use you so keep that um strength alive your person is definitely dating other people your person is definitely you know um uh, have options and kind of like you know i should not say this but yes they're sleeping around that's what i feel definitely and this is something that you must not allow in your life what is the potential outcome here you moving on you finding someone else in your life this new person that comes into your life is like a game changer this is like someone that's going to fill your heart with love and joy and respect you will be traveling or you may meet this person in a different place you might shift as well but this is worth someone that's worthy of you scorpio pisces cancer very loving caring and respectful lots of love in their heart for you compassion for you i told you So don't forget to subscribe, like, comment and share it. Do claim this read. I'll see you again. Bye.